What's up everyone? My name is Braskus and welcome back to We Happy Few. So I had a rather unfortunate incident. I loaded into the game and immediately ran into one of these guys and got attacked by him. I don't know why he didn't like me, but he beat the crap out of me. So now I really need to uh, heal myself up a bit. Luckily I've got all of this stuff. I should actually look up what some of these things do. I never found out what the antiseptic was for. Uh, kills infections even more useful on a bandage. So it's a crafting ingredient, but I don't really have a thing for that. Uh, right, the sick up tea, which makes me vomit. Restores a small amount of health. Although by small amount, it means like over half, so not a problem. I also tried to fight the guy with my fists just to see if I could do it, and it didn't go well, so I wound up beating the tar out of him with my uh, head whacker, which went much better. Um, Alright, I need to get off the, the main road, because that's where they all seem to be patrolling, and they don't like me out there. So, what I wanted to do in the first place was to come way over here and check out the dig spot that's over this way. Hopefully without, you know, getting attacked or... Yeah. I think this is the fountain Sally and I put the fish in. <laughs> we were witty in those days. Is it up here? Sure is. Loose dirt. Alright, got a bunch of stuff. Okay. So that's good enough for now, I think. Again, stay away from the open areas. Let's look at my map. See what else we got around here. Um, all right, so I don't have any other dig spots in the immediate areas. There are three of them way out over there, but I've got no idea where that is. So I think it's time that we head over this way. The Scottish play, cross the Inkerman Bridge and meet with Ollie. Okay. Okay. Just be careful from them. I think because it's dark out now, most of the people have gone inside and they're kind of like the in charge people of this area. Depressing though that might be. And so I need to be really careful about where I'm going. Uh... I guess that was a loading screen? I don't know what just happened there. Oh well. Ooh, hi. Ooh, shoot, there's two of them. Okay, there we go. Crept right between them and took right off. Okay, we're good. If I had to guess, that'll be their campsite. And Ollie's gonna be over here waiting for me. Well, now we're trespassing. Bridge to Ravensholm. The Scottish play. All right, present pass here. Oh, present pass here. Blech. Surrender personal weapons here. Home army personnel and authorized visitors only. All right, let's, um... Ooh, well, we're not going that way. I was gonna say, let's see if I can find another way in, but I'm willing to bet there isn't one. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> they are out on a ledge there, so I guess we're going in this way. Oh, jeez. I can't tell if they're asleep or if they're dead. Now, Ollie did say he was gonna make sure they got a good night's sleep. Open gate button, I don't wanna hit that button. All right, Let's see what we can do here. I know I'm trespassing. Ooh, bandages, clean bandages. Glass bottles, healing balm, healing balm. Rocks. I've got enough of those. I don't need any more. Alright. That was worth it. 
Infiltrators and spies will be bayoneted. Great. Now you two bloody listen to me, all right? One fine day, the sea boys come running into the regimental HQ, saying there's an elephant broke loose. Now, elephants is very gentle creatures most of the time, and they get along just fine with their man who rides. He's called a mahu. But when they're in heat, you have to chain them up. And this one, I got loose. And there's my hoofman chasing off in exactly the wrong direction. And the elephant runs into the market and starts eating peaches. And the coolie tries to stop him. And the elephant steps on him something horrible. Mashes him right Ugh. into the mud. And skin comes off his back like he was feeling good. So the sea boys come running up and they Okay. Never aim your gun at anyone you don't want to shoot. Never fire your gun at anyone you don't want to kill. Good advice. Alright, we're going in here, because I think there's a ladder that'll take me up, and I want to see what else is up there. Steal their scotch. And up we go. Oh, there's a memory up here. Glad I came up this way now. You can't go on it. They said I could. Well, of course the Germans said you could go on it. I'm saying you can't. I've never been on a battleship. But that's not the point. We hate the Germans, and that battleship is part of the reason the Germans are our lords and masters right now. Do you remember when they came over in all the little boats? Do you mean in 1942? Or in 1943. Do you want people to spit on Mum when she goes to the market? She doesn't go to the market since 1945. Oh, look, this is just one of those things. I can't explain every single detail of everything to you. Are you mad at me? D I'm not. You're not? I mean, yes, I am. I am mad. I was mad, but now I'm not. Look, please don't go on the Bismarck. It will get you into trouble, which means I'll then be in trouble. All right. You won't go? I couldn't go without you, anyway. For once, that's a relief. Man, they were really good brothers. All right, not. I just okay. I don't know if there's anything over on the other side. I don't really want to find out. Man, Ollie did some work out here if he did all this. And look at this. Like, there's one guy who's really drunk over there, and everyone else is knocked completely out. Oh. Fish the gate open. Oh, good. I can just open it. No fucking Ooh, civilian! Jesus. Uh, I have to kill you now. Christ. God. I let anyone see me out of uniform. Can I get a uniform? Because that would be nice. Thank God, Ollie. Right? Okay. Um, I really feel like I should not be out here on the open road outside of a crouch, but I'm gonna. Okay, so we've got spotlights everywhere. Attention, all personnel. Ah, guys patrolling the walls. Bunker. That way, okay. Is there... And there's not anywhere they're patrolling the wall on top. And I don't see anyone patrolling outside. Oh, there is a fire over here. Raw meat, charcoal, and a branch. And I think I'm good for now. Because looking at my inventory, I have 98 pounds worth of stuff. I need to stop carrying things. Unless I find something really valuable. Actually, let me look through my inventory here real fast. Is there anything I don't want? The lead pipe is nice, the shovels are nice, but they're seven pounds each, and I've already got two, or three. All right, I'm gonna drop a shovel, 
and a branch. Uh, which right there clears up almost 12 pounds. 10 pounds. Um, I'm going to keep most of the rest of this for the moment. Just dropping those two things was good. Okay. All right. So that's thing still pointing to the bunker. Bunker, bunker, bunker's in that way. The Victory Memorial Camp. Okay, so where am I? Stillery, latrine, front gate, observation tower. Okay, bunker over here, generator room right there. Though it does look like the bunker's not necessarily connected to the main part of the camp, which is a bit of a problem. But it looks like this is where I'm supposed to go anyway. Pure water now available in my journal. Sweet. You see five skill points. The Germans didn't take their tanks with them when they left. I've made a map. There's a hole in the fence inside the dump. You just have to get in here, get the key, and cut the power. Then sneak out into the darkness while I rob them blind. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. How do I cut the power? The general keeps the keys in his desk. You want me to break into the general's office? Anyway, you can scotch the power as fine by me, lad. I'll meet you back at the train station. What if they spot me? I'd run. They don't have a lot of ammunition, but they're terribly handy with their bayonets. That's your plan B? Run? Well, you could ask them for some of their famous hot buttered crumpets, but I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> they can't run very fast. They're all old farts, like me. Okay then. We shall never surrender. Yeah, except we did. Danke für all see that map die Regen für Rommel. I don't really know what any of that means. Moonshine recipe. Oh, only sleeping potion for those chaps on the bridge. I do not want to sleep in that bed. How am I looking, by the way? Eh, not too bad. Not great, but not too bad. Okay, now we can do this. Tippy toes, where sprinting makes no more noise than walking. I want that. Yes, buy that skill. Now, what else can I get here? Uh, people will ignore your annoying habits. That will be useful to have. Uh, throwing equals bigger distractions. 25% less visible at night. Curfew does not apply to the player. Witnesses won't react as quickly when you're trespassing. Yeah, that's one I really want to get to. So, like, these two are probably the next ones on my list unless something else takes precedence. Okay. We're off. Holy shit, there was a hole in the fence in the dump. In that the sounds much safer than walking in by the front gate. In the dump. Where is the dump? Okay, so the dump is over that way. If we're looking at the bunker here, I guess that would mean... I don't know where the dump is. It's outside the gate, though. Ooh, shit. Oh, wait. It's telling me where the dump is. Enter the dump. I'm just being stupid. <gasps> Memory. Up a tree. Arthur. Arthur? You get down from that tree before I chop it down. Do you know why they're registering us? The Germans love their lists, that's all. They're taking us away on a train to Germany. You know about it, don't you? Who told you that? It's ridiculous. Oh, oh you all know about it, just not the kids. Look, they've got cows there. It's not going to be powdered milk. They might even have chocolate. Oh, chocolate makes it all better. They've got tanks, Arthur. Why haven't you noticed? How are we supposed to argue with tanks? I don't want to go to Germany. It's only for a little while, I think. I don't want to be a hostage. Calm down. Let's have some tea. Oh, right. I'll, I'll come down. Jeez. Um, I 
think I might be stuck, actually. <laughs> yeah, that explains the terrible, horrible thing. Every child in Britain, apparently, had to go to Germany. Which, when you think about it, would, depending on the level of adoption that the Germans had, would kind of be the end of Britain. Alright, so I'm concealed. I'm trying to get over there. No dumping. Dump at your own risk if you must, but we do not like. But we, yeah, we don't like it. Okay. I'll take those. Where am I going? There was a hole in the fence. Oh dear. I mean, that looks like it should be a hole in the fence, but I can't pry it loose or anything. Brawler and canteen. Okay, so attacks with fists do slightly more damage. It is stackable. Two out of ten. But I can't get over there. Not directly. Ah, crap. No, this is over. I wouldn't mind having a couple with some of those gems. And some and no plan to avoid contact with the enemy, you know? Okay. Whoever said we passed this way but once? So, the sergeant says, I didn't see you at camouflage training, so I says, thanks. Okay, I can't see a goddamn thing. Um, all right, let's try this. And hope to God I don't have to murder the crap out of them all. I'm going to make office. What's that? Oh shit. That didn't work at all. Because they, like, immediately turned around, which means it's not going to help me at all. I mean, if I could get one of them over here, that would be great. Oh, wait a minute. Let me try something else. Okay, they're both paying attention over there now. So if I creep right along over here, and I'm now hidden... Then maybe I can throw a bottle over there? Okay, not far enough. Let's try throwing it here. And then over there. Okay. Throw this dart to draw people's attention away from where you are. Yeah, great. Who's there? Shit. Cuz... I still don't see the freaking hole. Damn it. Okay, um... Let me get the darts. It's supposed to itch. Oh, tell it to the Marines. Desert. We go Sorry, I didn't want to do this. Oh god, what the hell did he just do to me? Dying from your wounds need to heal yourself quickly. I can't even see what's going on. Go back to Germany, you swine! Ow! Okay. Sorry. I'm not. Mm. 
Where's the hole in this stupid fence? God damn it, man. Um, all right, let's take all that for now. Ugh. All right, where is the hole in this stupid fence? Is it up on top of this mound? That's all they wanted me to do. All right, here it goes. Yeah. We took all the kids to the train station. We sent them off to Germany because of Papier Mache. Hmm. All right, break into Bing's office is what it wants me to do now. And I probably want to avoid being in the lights. Yay, concealed. Um, Christ. Wait for the light to pass by. All right, we're gonna go out this way. Man, I wish it would give me a you are here. So if I came across from the dump into the tanks, now I'm out here in the depot. The generator room is right there. The general's office is way over there. Shoot. Okay. All right. We got this. If I found a loose bullet down the mud, do you think it could still be any... Probably not. At least I hope not. Oh, I can't sneak past that. Really? Okay. There is... Yay! Bushes for hiding. Okay, there's a waste bin over here. Big splinter. What the hell is that? Shit. Oh, come on, man. Attention all personnel. The Merry Band players will be performing their brilliant play, Happy Hamlet. All right, what is Big Splinter? I want to know what that is. Is it a weapon? Flimsy cricket bat. Um, no. What the hell is Big Splinter? Outfits. Big splinter. A pointy shard of wood could be used to make a dart. Because I don't have a billion of those. Drop it. At 8 p.m. in the mess hall. All are invited. Ooh. Don't worry. In Happy Hamlet. Oh, no Christ. Shit, 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 shit. Ooh. 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 <laughs> okay. So now I'm nice and hidden in the bushes. If it moves, salute it. If it don't move, put it you don't know that for sure. If you can't move, move. Alright, so there's more bushes over there. And over there. I'm trying to get 72 okay, meters that way, on. though. Patrols should be particularly careful in the forest. More than the usual number of plague victims have been spotted there recently. Okay, I see more bushes over that way. So I'm going to wait for them to move past that direction. Fuck it, we're running now. Alright, because I can run now without making any more noise than walking.
which seems like a pretty viable strategy for avoiding being caught. If I can run from patch to patch without being noticed. Okay. I am still concealed. So far, so good. Attention all personnel. If you find any plague mushrooms inside the camp, please notify Corporal Ramsbottom so they can be eradicated safely. Okay. I think I see the general's quarters. They're 39 meters straight down that way. How far do these guys patrol? Ooh. Do they patrol or did they just hang out there? Looks like they might just hang out there, which is a problem for me. Alright, I'm going to have to make a run back to that group of bushes in just a second. Go! Okay, one guy coming back this way. Now the other two walked off and they're going to be gone for a while. So once he passes me, I'm going to try and make a run for those bushes there on the other side of this street. And go! This sucks. Okay, hug the wall here. Don't see anybody there. Hug the wall here. There are some people over there, but no one in here. Okay, so far so good. More bushes over there. There are not more bushes over there. There are some way over there. Just get around way over to here. Okay, and we're concealed again. This is kind of nerve-wracking to me. I'm not great at first-person stealth like this. I feel like I'm pretty decent at stealth when I'm allowed to kill the people that are in my way. But I can't really effectively do that in this situation. Okay. So I'm effectively here. Looks like there's some guys out front, but not out back. I just kind of want to look around here. Oh god, they're over there. Okay, they're on that side though. I don't see anyone patrolling this sideway. So I'm gonna go for it. I don't have a way to silently pick lock yet, locks yet either, which is another thing I need to do. Oh, he said the key was in General Bing's office. Okay, lock it. Let's not trigger the alarm. Examine bookshelf. On this bookcase, isn't there? I feel positive there's something that could open this. Okay. Uh, read the sheet music. Note, chord, note. What a jolly tune. Maybe I should play it. Yep. Maybe. Uh, let's see. Look at all those tanks. Sally and I used to go and stare at them. Wonder if they were fun to drive. She wanted to be a rocket ship pilot, but I think a tank would have made her reasonably happy. The grown-ups tried very hard never to be somewhere they could see the tanks or the military camp, and it being out in the rubble, that wasn't too hard for them. I wonder why the Germans left them behind. I mean, once they had the kids, didn't they need the tanks because the Soviets were smashing them to pieces in the east? There's a very real chance I shall go and get myself killed. It's an odd sensation. On the one hand, I'm absolutely terrified. On the other hand, I haven't had an adventure since Sally fucked off. 
I used to think I'd run into her. How have I never run into her? It's been 14 years, and I want her to explain to me how she could have ever done that. And I don't want to. I want to forget the whole horrible, sordid thing and be the two musketeers again. I used to have a whole speech memorized. Or maybe she's already got a new musketeer. A girl like Sally makes new friends so easily. The lads across the street would literally stop talking and watch her go by. She always got a kick out of that. Oh Christ, this is not what I signed up for when I went off joy. All I wanted to do was get the hell out. I mean, to find Percy. Can't I bloody pick and choose what memories I get back? Well, if I get bayoneted to death, problem solved, so there's that. Ollie's moonshine recipe, two bags of sugar, fire, water, etc. <laughs> Papier mache and plywood tanks? Christ, we never rose up because of fake tanks. We gave them the kids because of fucking fake tanks. All right, so I know what I'm supposed to do. Hello, music, guy. Eh? Maybe I should have a read and play it. In a minute. In a minute. Okay, nothing there. Okay, I'm gonna do this first. Oh, dude's got bobby pins right there. Duct tape and scotch. Absolutely not in his desk. Why doesn't that surprise me? All right, so I can search these, but there's probably not gonna. Ooh, I was about to say there's probably not much in them, but I'm wrong. Ew. Sounds like someone had a little too much to drink there. That or the whole plague mushrooms thing. I do not want to unlock that. I don't really care about the empty pill bottle or the teacups at this point. I'm good. Guide to fitting in. I will take that. Reduces all suspicion rates. Alright, now what did they say it was? Note chord note. So note, chord, note. Well, I like clever clogs. That's the general. It if it leads underground like the others, I can use it to get out of here once I'm done. Take that. Okay, now hold E, enter hatch, sabotage the generator. Okay, so I have to sabotage the generator first, and then haul ass here to open the hatch. Great. All right, so... Oh, look at my map's really not going to help at this point, is it? Man, brothers, enter the power shed, which is on the other freaking side of the place. Okay, that's fine. Unlock it. Open it up. Close it behind me. Okay, so I need to basically just go back the way I came from, it looks like, and head that direction. It's not that far away. It's like 80 meters. I should be able to do 80 meters without too much trouble. 69 meters, okay. Now, ooh, shit. That was close. Okay, forget that nonsense, we'll go this way. God, that guy really just perked right up there, didn't he? Okay, there's a dude over there, we're gonna try and sneak by this way. This is what this is gonna be. Run from bush to bush to bush to bush to bush. Uh-oh. Um, kind of out of bushes. Uh, guess I'm going this way. Still concealed. I don't see any footprints. Don't see anybody either. Oh, Christ. Shoot. Oh, come on. Okay, so there are some flower bushes on the other side of that fence. God, there's guys right over there too, though. That's the problem. All right, we're concealed. Mother! Okay, we good. I'm freaking out a little bit, but for the most part, we're good. 
Alright, I see some more bushes, but they're way the hell over there. Okay. I gotta wait for that thing to pass back this way, though, because it's gonna pass over me, and it's not gonna take long. Okay, go now. For these. Sweet. Okay. How far away? 49 meters. Attention all personnel. Some of the latrines are in the process of being moved from the old home to brand new. Ooh, okay, hi. If you see a latrine somewhere you're not used to, please make sure it is actually over. Is that you? For reasons I shouldn't have to explain. Okay, I'm gonna come over in this direction. How far? 35 meters. Okay. So far, so good. I gotta head that way here. So, we're gonna go this way. Oh, okay, I know where I am now. This is that Attention same road I took last time. Tonight's movies will be Hellcats at Ramsgate. Okay. This stirring war movie shows one of Britain's finest victories. Don't miss it. Okay, I don't see anybody. Oh shit, that thing, except that guy right over there. Which way is he going? Okay, he's going that way. I don't see any of their footprints anywhere registered, so we should be good. Okay, 10 meters that away. Let's sneak around the outside of this for two reasons. One, sometimes they've got doors out this way, and two. Ooh, God, there's a guy over there. Gotta be careful of that. Um, Christ, okay. We are concealed. Nobody over there, okay. Sweet. Oh, there's a guy over there, though. Okay. Open or unlock. Can I... There we go. Open it. Close it. Now, hopefully, there's nobody in here. Unfortunately, it sounds like there is. Shit. I heard him. Unless it's the guy outside, maybe. Well, I mean, I don't hear anybody in here. Oh, that way goes outside. Okay, so I think I'm alone in here. At least I desperately hope so. Holy crap, man, I'm up to 94 pounds of stuff again. Alright. Okay, is there anything I can craft? to reduce some of my my weight here. Um, I can craft dirty bandages if I want, but I'd rather not. I can craft suits, but I'd rather not. I can craft a repair kit. Let's see. What does this do? Nothing you can't fix with duct tape, fix leaks, holes, and mechanical problems in many circumstances. All right, let's make like three of these. I don't necessarily know what good that does me, but I'll do it. Caltrops is metal bits. Uh, let's make, like, two or three of those. Oh, okay, so some things I have to be at a workbench to craft, head knockers being one of those things. Antiseptic is made using rubbing alcohol, rotten potatoes, and pure water. All right, well, that's all fine. Okay, so that freed up, like, a pound. What do I need for silently pick locks, jimmy windows, and search containers? Okay, so that needs body snatcher before I can get to that. Plus two uses for Jimmy Bars, plus one use for disarming tools. Also good stuff. So, man, that really makes things harder to do. Because I want both of those as well. But I think I'm going to take the Body Snatcher one real quick, because if I can get the points for it, the ability to silently pick locks would be useful immediately. Okay, so I can use switches to shut off everything. But my concern is that when I do that, I'm going to freak everybody out. Short spike, duct tape, and scotch. Not going to worry about that. 
I will, however, take the bobby pins. Did I just take everything? I did. Fine. Oh, workbench right here. Okay. Um, I mean, there's only one thing I can make at a workbench. Well, I can make proper shoes if I had more shredded raincoat, but I don't. Pure water requires a water filter and tap water. Healing balm requires those things. Yeah, I know. Um, okay, how much... So, making one of these takes up a rock, duct tape, and a branch. How much do each of those things weigh individually versus how much does the head knocker itself weigh? The head knocker is 7 pounds. A rock is 0.3 pounds. A branch is 3 pounds. And duct tape is... 0.2 pounds, so frankly, crafting more of those weapons is heavier than it would be without it. So, yeah. Attention all personnel. Soldiers found drunk on duty. <sighs> given 30 days in the brig. Don't know that for sure. Soldiers found trafficking in contraband will be court martialed and dishonorably discharged from the home army. All right, here we go. What? All right. Here goes. Oh, for fuck's sake, Ollie. He knew it was a lie, didn't he? I bet he bloody knew. Escape the military camp. How do I get out of here? I'm not going to be able to jump over the fence from this side. Don't have to. Get back to the general secret hatch. That's my way out. It sure is. Now everybody knows what's going on. So they're all going to be on high alert, but we're smart, we're fast, I trust that we can do this. Okay. So far so good. Watch for him over there. Come on, I know you're gonna leave. You did last time. I just wait for you to turn around and go somewhere else. Ah, crap. He's not really going, though, is he? He's just kind of pacing around up there. Is he just gonna be, like, paused right there? Yeah, I don't think he's gonna move. He's gonna hang out right there. Okay. So far, so good, then. We'll just have to go around the guy. Ooh. Okay. So far, so good. Shit, that guy's over there. Okay, can I... All right. Three... Give me glass bottles again. Man, I'm not... That is not making him go further away, though. That's the problem. Oh, okay. Can't believe that worked. Did not expect it to. Fully expected him to know exactly where I had gone. Okay, now there is another guy in this area, but I don't know where he freaking is. That's the problem. Oh, shit. There's no bushes nearby. There's some over here. <laughs> okay, we're safe. Safe being an extremely relative term right now. Okay, there's more over here. Now. Those guys are going to be my next big issue, aren't they? Oh, stay concealed, please. There's a guy looking, like, right at it, isn't there? Shit. Okay, let's go over here. Duck into these bushes real fast. Because I need to be able to see around here. Frick, man. Okay. There are bushes right here, but how far do they extend? Christ, there's like three of them right over there. 
I mean, if I absolutely had to, I could probably run to the generals and, and manage this, but... God, they're all right there. All right, can I... Yeah, not really. Well, maybe. Can I toss it over here? Who's there? Yes, but I'm immediately regretting doing that. Toss it over that way. Who goes there? There we go. That did what I wanted it to do. Okay, now no one's paying attention, right? No guard in front of the general's area, nobody back that way. So the two poor bastards in the dump are the only ones who found me. Lock it. Can I go up this before I leave? No. Fine by me. Getting the hell out of here. <laughs> that went pretty well. Oh, I'm not done. Not done yet. Newspaper and fucking glue. Right. Now, if I can make it back to Ollie alive, he'll help me get out of town. Assuming that wasn't another lie, that won't be an awful conversation at all, will it? Shit, there's a dude over there. Let's not go that way. Bog. Is there any reason not to go in the bog? Is the bog bad for me in some way? Histoplasma? Oh, a dead guy. Uh, let me search Wally Sharon. Wally's got nothing. But he's got histoplasma. We'll take those. What does that do? I should find out. Is that That's not food, is it? Uh, no. It's not considered meds. What the hell is histoplasma? Um, okay. How is this stuff organized? I really wish it was, like, alphabetized or something. Um, okay, so short spike. Shorts out control boxes for good. Moldy bread, stew, caltrops, metal bits. Where the hell is this stuff? Rotten mushrooms. Empty syringe, bandage, rowan berries, blue currants, rotten apple, rotting meat. Was I like... Ah, there it is. Cleanses the doors of perception. Don't say I didn't warn you. Causes hallucinations for a short time. It's a crafting ingredient. Okay. Well, that's basically what I wanted to know. Where the hell am I? I do not remember coming this way. It's kind of cool, though. What the hell? What is this? Like a bunker out here or something. Doesn't really look like there's any way to go, but it's kind of neat that it's here. Alright, forget it. We need to just get out of here. Ooh. In the still of night, pick up Ollie's brew for Ollie's recipe for strange brew and steal two bags of sugar. Where the hell am I? I am way out here, aren't I? How am I looking, by the way? Hunger is pretty bad, thirst is pretty bad, fatigue is pretty bad. We're not doing great right now. And they want me to do something in there. The distillery. Go figure, and there's one guy way over there. Um, ring the bell at the... Oh, that's the wrong thing. You know what? I don't think I want to do this right now. I'm not in a position to do it. I can come back later when I feel better equipped for it. 
Right now, I honestly just want to find my way out of this place and get to the train station. Which means I am on the wrong freaking side of this place. Okay. This should take me back to the bunker. Okay, if I eat some more food... Then at least I'll be able to sprint longer. God, get around the rocks. Okay, we're back to the bunker now. All right, so we're getting close to the entrance back. All right, I'm gonna eat some stew real quick. Rotten onion, rotten apple, rotten mushroom stew. Ah, better. Now we're good. I can sprint way longer without needing to worry about anything. Okay, but this is where I have to start being careful again because somewhere, that's where it is, okay. I guess the next question is, are these guys as, are they still all doped up? Or do I have to start sneaking my way through here now too? Seems like they're still pretty doped up. There was the one guy, is he gone now? That or he's just completely drunk off his ass. Oh, it's jammed, so there's no way for me to open that. Okay. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Sweet, all right. Ugh. Looted the night blooming nonsuch. Let's pick those up. I don't know what they do. But I imagine they're crafting ingredients, so they gotta be useful for something later. Alright, let me look at my map real fast, because I might need to make a stop by the safe house. Workbench chemistry set track access hatch. Okay, I wanna go there first. Uh, which is also that way, I guess. This way? I don't know. Look at my map. Yeah, I'm headed the right way. Um, I want to drop some stuff off at the pneumatic access thing. So I'm not carrying quite so much stuff everywhere. Perfect. It's right over here. Hop inside. Right down here. Okay. Alrighty then. Happy to see myself here. Okay. Pneumatic access hatch is over here. Yes. Da, da, da. Move to container. Sorry, here. Move all crafting items to the stash. Yes. That did not free up as much space as I would have liked. Um... Okay, well, I don't need to carry everything, so let's move this over. And a couple of... Well, we'll move a branch. Um, I will move... I'm gonna keep most of those. I probably don't need 15 bottles of scotch, so let's move, like... 10 of those over. The repair kit I will keep. That'll keep... Actually, I don't know what to do with these. Increases weight limit slightly. But I think I have to equip that or something. Um, I'm going to keep it for now. Um, antiseptic I'll keep. This becomes a crafting ingredient, so I'm going to put those away. Um, I don't need... I really only... If I'm going to carry a rock, I only need one for crafting. Um, moldy bread I'll keep. That's fine. Let's move nine of the bottles. So I've got 10 left, that's fine. Rotting meat can cause food poisoning, increases maximum stamina for a very brief time. I'm probably gonna get rid of that. 
That's something I wouldn't really want to eat unless I absolutely have to. Crafting ingredients. Uh, can give food poisoning. Can give food poisoning. I should just get rid of these. Dirty bandages. I probably only need four of those at most. That's a crafting ingredient. I don't need 22 of these. We'll deposit 10 of or 12 of them. Keep those for food. Keep those for food. Keep crafting. Clean bandage I'm going to keep on me. Is there anything else I need to worry about? Uh, I think I'm kind of good. I'm going to put away the flimsy cricket bat. I don't need that either. If I've got this head knocker, I'll keep the lead pipe as an alternative for when this breaks. And I've got enough stuff to craft a new one if I need it. Um, I probably also don't need five jimmy bars. We'll keep two. I can always make another one if I need to, so I'm not going to remember that too much. And I think I'm good for now. Yeah, so that's cleared up quite a lot of space. Even better. Now we all forget things from time. All right, now look at my statistics here. How are we doing? We could really use some sleep. So let's go ahead and do that for, I guess, an hour is fine. Try not to dream about trains. Okay, and at this point, guys, I am out of time for this episode. This has been going on for a full hour, so on the beginning of the next episode, we'll have to go and track down Ollie and see what the hell he's doing sending us into an alarmed station like that. But hopefully he got what he wants, and hopefully he can get us to the next part of this game. We have all kinds of stuff ready. I'm really hoping it will get me... Uh, a bunch of skill points. I mean, five at least gets me access to Sneak Thief. Eight would get me up to Night Stalker, which would be awesome. I mean, these two, just, just by themselves, those two would be amazing. Um, as with that one, like, these three, I feel like will get me out of a lot of trouble. Past that, there's plenty of them that could be useful. Um, this one would be good, too. Uh, Ear to the Ground would be nice so that I can see further away and know where they all are. I haven't even touched combat, but there's plenty of bonuses, but we'll worry about that later, so... Thank you all so much for joining me. I hope you're enjoying this series as much as I am. If you're having fun with it, please make sure you hit that like button. Feel free to leave a comment down in the section below. And as always, guys, I'll see everyone in the next episode. Catch you guys later.